Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was risen from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us, in symbolism. And on our channel, we bring all this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, today is Tuesday, May 26, 2015, and they've come out with a new Google Doodle here for Sally Ride. For many years, we have been showing how nearly all of these Google Doodles are as vision boards right in front of us showing the end times coming. It's not just this. If you've, you've noticed the chaos spreading all around the world and that we're nearing that time in the Bible where we're nearing the end. A, nearing a cataclysmic event. You can see that most of the world leaders are ready for World War III. It's the spiritual realms that are preparing all of this. It's all of Scripture must be fulfilled. Now Sally here, God bless her soul, she died of pancreatic cancer in July 23rd, 2012. Right here. Sally Ride. This is all symbolizing the woman of the Bible that very, very few people know about through there. See, she died in La Jolla, California of pancreatic cancer, which has a lot to do with like pan coming also. Pan coming after the woman. See this Economist magazine cover? One of billions of other things that are right in front of you that so show the end times coming. See here, this red side of the world is rising up. See Pan, the Pied Piper right here, coming with Russia, like the serpent after the woman. There's the woman of Revelation 12. There is Sally Ride with her ship, right there. It represents a rapture situation. When Jesus takes the woman and the wise virgins away, during a giant earthquake that hits the USA and sets up this red side of the world to rise up with the secret government of the USA. All right there. And the red side of the world is actually turned into batteries as all of Jesus' people are taken to heaven and go on this holiday. And then Jesus actually makes all the people that are didn't believe in him and makes everybody worship at our feet. See right there? It's all in scripture. It's all perfect. There is one scene of the rapture going right there. See everybody going up? The catching away, as they call it. Here is the woman, Sally Ride of Revelation 12. The dragon is coming. The red side of the world is coming, and she is granted the wings of a great eagle to escape during that time. Here comes the big dragon all coming, the many-headed beast, and there's her ship to get out of here, right there. In Revelation 3 is one of the places it talks of a rapture. Because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I also will keep thee from the hour of temptation which shall come up on all the world to try them that dwell on the earth. This is going to be a great temptation on this side to take this mark of the beast. And it's going to be the same temptation that was for Eve and Adam in the Garden, the garden of Eden to eat from this fruit and that you can be as gods. That's what the trick is right there. But really it's just going to destroy everybody. That's even the nuclear football kicked. So this is a great temptation in the mark of the beast. Because if you don't take this, you have to go to the guillotines. But if you go to the guillotines, you'll end up over here with us going to heaven. Look, there's even Britain being nuked. <clears throat> so we're taken away from the great temptation. And this is where he makes them worship at our feet. Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come and worship before thy feet, and to know that I have loved thee. There we are. It's the same thing as right here. See, we are all as spirits in heaven on a holiday. And now everybody is below us, worshiping at our feet exactly as talked of in the Bible. Literally, right there. So we have here, here we are in mission control. She has like five of these images. It shows mission control. 
and it shows some things going on down here with Antarctica and stuff. The foundation of the world and the black and the white. Like it's time for us all to go. See Mission Control? The woman like with the Holy Ghost and such. Here's another one where she's setting everything up. See how she's behind here? And she's working all of the people, getting the different people. This is a woman, an actual angel. Right there. There are actually angels involved in this. Most of humanity cannot grasp this. Even Christians are like, oh, what's going on? You mean angels are doing things? Yes, they got jobs. There's going to be a war in heaven even. So there she is setting everything up. And here she is making sure everything's in place. Getting everything just right. Here she is, the children are coming to her, and she's giving them their oil, as it's called in the Bible. See the ship? See the oil? Basically, in the Bible, it's called the wise virgins will have their oil to be able to go to heaven. Castral oil. The wise virgins have their oil, just like a suit. See, our covering cherub. See, she's being sent to heaven. Thank you. The woman of the Bible. Jesus Christ is from the seed of the woman. And here she is. Everybody's going up. And then the great tribulation and the red is coming. It's, it's all part of a balance through here. God have mercy on us all. So there it is. You see, see how she died down in San Diego? I've been showing that this is, this is about where the beginning is going to end. She even died on July 23rd, which has a lot to do with the eagle of July 20th is when the moon landing happened. And that is when the eagle has landed. The woman granted the wings of an eagle, the side of the blue. San Diego, they have the San Onofre power plant. It's turned off. It's just a big bomb. It's part of when Jesus and the woman bruised the beast's head through there. All of it's going by scripture. And that's where the beginning will all happen. The San Andreas fault line will go and such. If you have your oil, you will make it through this event. And then a great deception is sent upon the world to test everybody that didn't believe in Jesus. And the lukewarm Christians will be tested. Right there. That is coming for 42 months. Now let's show this here. We've mapped this out all around the world for a long time now. See her ship? That's the wings of the Great Eagle. This is London, England. If you're new to my channel, welcome to the Matrix. I was woken up by God several years ago and told to go and map out the world and show how everything is prepared for the end days. This is one of many places we've mapped out. We've nearly mapped out every major city on the planet and the whole planet. Everything's going along like a matrix to the Bible. This is London. We'll go right up here near Who and Slow. Who the Doctor Who character represents the false prophet and the Antichrist type figure coming. Yes, the same one on the TV show. If you haven't watched that show, you will notice that he does not like Christians, he does not like Jesus Christ, and he does not seem to believe in any type of end times and things. He's an Antichrist through there. This right up here, this is the woman, Sally Ride. There is the ship, the wings of the Great Eagle. You see how it has this donkey on top? It represents when Jesus Christ rode the, rode the cult of an ass into the temple. He will ride this again into the temple of God. This up here represents the dog star Sirius, part of God's throne, and the star Bethlehem. When you sit up here, you're in charge. This is the right hand side, the side of grace and mercy. This is the left hand side, the satanic accusing figure. See how he has this big giant dragon coming after the woman? See, this is him falling. Some have even said this will be a stone or a ship. See how this goes up? Perfect. Who in slow? 363. Doctor Who is the Antichrist. See right there? There he is sitting in there. See how this is falling on these two domes, exactly like the San Onofre power plant area. His head will be bruised, and then he will rise back up with the New World Order. We will be put into the ship and escape all the wise virgins. There's Sally Ride right there. The pyramid is part of the Bible. It's, it's supposed to cap off the abyss. See the dragon coming out from the bottom? That represents him being set loose. Right now, on this side, the angels can come all up and down and go into the different human being hosts. This side we are virgins. See how we have to fly? 
and we have to pass over him coming. This big figure here of this woman represents the earth. See how she has her breasts? And it says in the Bible, the earth will help this woman. Don't worry, we got this. Watch. I'll show you. That's what God sent me here to do. To help all of us. See here? And the serpent cast out of his mouth water as a flood after the woman that he might cause her to be carried away of the flood. And the earth helped the woman, and the earth opened her mouth and swallowed up the flood which the dragon cast out of his mouth. That's the giant event and the earthquake and everything as we bruise his head and we take off out of here. Let's show all of this really quickly right here. You have to see the balance. Do you see the left hand and the right hand? That's the way to see this. And then you can know that, I mean, it's all going according to script. Can you see this jet right there? There it is. Can you see this pyramid right here? There it is. Can you see this shoe right here? The shoe represents the foot of Jesus Christ. When his heel is bruised, it will bruise the beast's head right underneath there. See him there? The beast. He is the same thing as the Doctor Who character we just saw over there to the right. See how this is filling up with the oil? And then we have to go through the moon. The woman on the moon. Diana. We have to go by the fountain. See here? Just like the woman that stands on the moon. See the woman standing on the moon. There we go. See how it's all going perfectly? We have our oil. We are on the plane, the jet. We get our flaming chariot, exactly like Elijah did. We ascend to the wedding feast of the Lamb. And then the bears come after everybody that's been laughing about all of this. Exactly as in 2 Kings when Elisha sent the bears after the children who mocked him. Everybody that was lukewarm and didn't believe in Jesus Christ will have the bears coming after him. So you can see all of that right there. My God, right there, man. Isn't that awesome? You can see the Indian woman right here representing Sally Ride. There she is. Let's go over here. Right here is the Doctor Who character sitting in here coming with his sword. He brings World War III and such all through there. There he is. He comes with his sword and this rabbit to trick the world. Now watch, he is the dragon. Doesn't really matter if you like him. See that dragon, perfect by the lines? I mean perfect, guys. That's Doctor Who. The left hand and the right hand. He's the left hand. <clears throat> you go with him, you get tricked. But you can see all of that there. And then all the way up to the dog star. Right here. Just as we've been showing for years on our channel. Same thing. It's the same thing down here. Watch. London has the same exact thing. I'm not going to redo this one. We've mapped it out a thousand times. Please find my old one. This is London. This is Buckingham Palace. And it shows Prince William as the little horn. See this dragon with the little horn? It says the dragon will give him his power. There's Russia. There's this new type of The Eucharist right here being given out. This is all the Revelation 13 beast out of the sea. The feet of a bear. The mouth of a lion. The body of a leopard. This represents Obama right here setting everything up. See this pirate character like a spirit? He goes right through the dog star and into Prince William, the beast out of the sea. All perfect right there. See the V coming? This stone represents the great millstone coming right there. And there is the boat, <clears throat> the ship, Sally Ride. We go all the way up here to the shepherd's bush, to this boot. See that right there? Just like Moses talked to God through the burning bush. We go right through, right to heaven. Now, let's show this right here. This same picture has been shown over and over and over again for a long time. It's right here also on the Hopi Prophecy Rock. 
This is called Mesol, the great millstone that is coming. That guy, the doctor. Right here is where Jesus Christ was. Do you see right there the cross? And then we've had two world wars. This is the great shaking. See this dark line? This is all of us on our boat. The same thing that we just showed. The fourth age. We all pass over this great millstone. Another type of Nazi German thing is coming. It's the great millstone. And the earth is harvested. This is us passing over. As we leave, we drag up that guy. See the boat as it's leaving? See the hook? And it's dragging up all of these guys, the horsemen and such, all through there. The same thing is mapped out in Washington. It's mapped out all around the world. There it is right there. The right hand side is grace and mercy. The left hand side is the accuser coming right there with World War III and his sword. So that's what's going on. That's what all of this has been symbolizing right here. And it all starts down in San Diego by the San Onofre power plant. Oh no, he's free. See the two domes? Just as we've been showing over and over and over again. Sally Rod, time for us to get out of here. See there? The rapture. It's going to be a giant earthquake, guys. Volcanoes are going to go off. Yellowstone's supposed to go off. The earth will be moved at this time. This is not a small event. This is the day the dead rise. Here it's shown all over the place. This is the United Nations. It shows it right here. This egg represents the nukes coming. This side is where everybody rises, the dead rise, and we go through this cabinet to heaven on the blue side. This is the side with the jet. This over here is the Doctor Who side. See him right here? And the woman riding the beast and such? Right there, the red side. He comes down with the white horse to deceive the world. The dead rise to utter contempt. There's the beast we just showed underneath the pyramid with the sword. The exact same thing. And it, it's in the United Nations, right there in front of us. It's right here. This is that Doctor Who guy coming right here to deceive the world, turn everybody into robots. We have to leave. See the eagle granted to the woman, and the dead will rise. Over and over and over again. See, that little child got her oil. A wise virgin invited to the wedding feast of the Lamb. See, she's setting everything up. It's all being done. Notice the blue all over the place. See the blue? There's your oil. And here comes the rapture, and here comes the red side. We had, we had to cross through the Red Sea with Moses last time, remember? When we had to go through Pharaoh. Here comes Pharaoh and his Red Sea. We are going to cross through them again, and not only that, I, keep, I don't like to tell this part too much. We're setting a trap. Yeah. As Jesus Christ and all is bringing all these people out. See, they're all going to be condemned. You see that? They're all condemned to hell. They're following the Pied Piper to death. As we cross the Red Sea, we are going to destroy Pharaoh and the Red Side, just as when they chased Moses, trying to chase... Moses to the promised land and the Red Sea fell in on them and destroyed them all. The war will destroy all of them. They're all gonna, it's all done. They're all gonna fall for a trick. Thank you very much everybody. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. And we're gonna have all of them worshiping at our feet. The Reds will be turned into batteries. Thank you very much, everybody. God have mercy on us all. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ is the only way.